had 15 cop cars out here. I called the cop and said there's a man that to meet to have sex with what he thought was a 13-year-old kid, and nobody will show up. I love doing what I do. It's almost like being a, a superhero. When I do this thing, it's the most euphoric high you could ever have. There he goes. Everything's going to the DA in state New York, brother. It gives me great gratitude in helping someone that may be a victim. I'm not here to be friends with these guys. I'm here to expose you and shame you. Well, Tony is a plumber. He's the father of two children. And Tony, as you were saying, your motivation here is clear. You've been on the bad end of this because you were a victim as a child, right? Yes. And I'm very sorry about that, by That's the right. way. So you get satisfaction. It, it's curative for you. It's cathartic for you to do this. Yeah, it's almost like a... It's almost like psychiatry, I guess you'd call it. Mm -hmm. So what is your method of pedophile hunting? What do you, how do you do this? It's very simple. Uh, you know, we post ads on a lot of different uh, platforms. We'll say, uh, you know, we're 19 or 20 because we can't make a profile being the age of 13 or 14. And um, when somebody messages us, we'll let them know, you know, listen, my age isn't 18 or 19. I'm really 13, 14, or 15. And we'll just sit back and wait and listen and see what they're going to do. So you put you you don't put an ad up and say, I'm a 13 year old waiting no. to be exploited. You you say I'm of age, mm -hmm. but then when they respond, you I, then say I let them I'm, know immediately, immediately, and you don't bait them in terms of any sexual provocativeness or anything no. like that. We don't initiate any sex track. Um, I'm I'm so. Uh, I don't even use emojis, kissy emojis, winky emojis, nothing yeah. like that. Okay, and, and you say decoys that talk to them, they need to talk to them for at least two weeks yes. to find out if, in fact, they've got bad intentions and they're going to follow through with it. And you say you have no fear and you're exposing predators in the biggest city in the world on the meanest streets in that city. Yeah. But you're a one-man band. That's it. You just show up just you. That's it. Just me. Okay. And how many, you've got 40,000 followers on your website. How many predators have you exposed? That's, it's about 30 plus, I would say. Okay. And what happens when you expose them? We expose them and then we're, we usually give the information over to uh, New York State Police. And um, we wait for their response. It's, it really hasn't been a positive response from them. Um, we had more luck when we busted a New York City school teacher, um, which I think, I think all these guys should be treated the same. It shouldn't matter what status you are. Are you worried about your safety when you're out there? No. Because this, these are mean, I mean, our producer was out there with you and their car got burglarized while they were shooting with you. That's true, yeah. We actually chased, we actually chased the guy down. His pants fell, he dropped all the stuff, but they got their stuff back. Yeah. But they, they chased him down the street. I, I believe anybody that's out to meet a child is a coward. And if, I, if I'm scared of them, I'm in, the wrong, I'm in the wrong field. I've done things with criminals in, in the field and things like that, but I always contact law enforcement. They don't go with me. I go with them. They, they're the professionals. They says. Well, he just says he's an embarrassment to the movement. We're going to find out why he says that and meet this person next. She's talking to a 28-year-old male who thinks that she's 14. Going to be bus number 201 around 6.15 is when we should be expecting him to be pulling up. All right, decoy, see if we can get him out of the car. Uh, I got eyes on him right now. He is here. And later... I'm recording for your safety and mine. You don't know who I am. My name's Jess You want to lie to me? Oh, you want to lie to me? You're not going over to me right in my truck. I just pulled across the traffic. You